guys welcome back to my channel how are you guys doing so today's video is going to be on this makeup look right here which is a sunset cut crease eye makeup look so if you guys want to know how to create this look then please keep on watching so i'll start with my eye makeup first today and for that i'm going to use this nika k23 color eyeshadow palette and i'm going to take that white eyeshadow and put it all over my crease if you guys don't have this palette you can use any other eyeshadow palette that you own then I'm using this yellow eyeshadow from a really inexpensive eyeshadow palette and I'm going to put this into my crease. So the eyeshadow palette that I'm using is from Kiss Beauty I believe like I'll, uh, I don't exactly remember it so I'm going to write it down in my description box. Uh, now what I'm basically doing is that I'm adding this yellow color into my crease and then taking a fluffy brush and blending it all the way up to my brow bone. So I'm going to take a little color at a time, blend it and then add more color and blend it again. Then I'm going to take this orange color from my Nikake eyeshadow palette once again and put this below the yellow in my crease again. So I'm actually creating a transition from orange to yellow. So I'm going to take a little again, blend it, add more color and this is what I'm basically going to do. You have to go step by step adding very little at a time and then blending further so that you know there's a beautiful transition going on. Then I'm taking this red and adding it below the orange. So I'm going to create a transition from the red to orange to yellow. And what I'm doing is that I'm adding a little bit and then blending it with the orange. And then I'm going to add a little bit more and I'm going to intensify the red. But at the same time, I'll make sure that all the three colors are visible so that the yellow, orange and the red is visible and so that there is a beautiful transition just the way we generally see in the evening sky when there is a sunset. Now it really doesn't matter if it's coming to your lid because you are going to cut your crease and you are going to clean up your lid anyway. Then I'm going to take some concealer and I'm going to apply this on my lid first and with the help of a flat brush I am going to cut my crease. Now here you really don't want to make a mistake because if you make a mistake over here then it's going to be a big mess. So make sure you do it really carefully. Once I'm done with that I'm going to take this white eyeshadow once again and I'm going to apply it on the areas where I have applied the concealer. This is going to lock in the concealer and it's also going to help the orange, red and yellow to pop up furthermore. For primer I'm going in with the color bar primer and for foundation I'm going to use my Nykaa Skin Genius foundation and I'm going to apply it with the help of a brush. Before you start with your base makeup make sure that you brush off any extra fallout uh, from the eyeshadow and this is the reason why I did my eye makeup first. Then for concealer I'm going to use my Maybelline Fit Me concealer again and I'm going to apply it under my eyes because I do have some darkness around my eyes and I'm also going to apply this on all high points of my face so that it highlights those areas. I will set my face with the help of my Maybelline Fit Me compact. I'm going to skip contouring in this look so I'm basically bronzing up my face slightly and for that I'm going to use my staple favorite uh, bronzer from Makeup Revolution and I'm going to use the same um, palette for my blush as well as my highlighter. For my brows as well today I'm again going to use one of my most favorite brow pencils which is from Maybelline. This one is such a good pencil guys trust me if you have not yet tried it I will suggest you guys to give this one a try. For eyeliner I'm going to use my Wet n Wild Pro Line eyeliner and this one makes it really easy to apply your eyeliner and I'm basically just drawing a wing. For my lower lash line I'm going to pick up this uh, beautiful purple shade and I'm going to apply it with the help of a pencil brush and once I'm done applying it I'm going to slightly smoke it out with the help of another brush. For my waterline I'm going in with this white eye pencil from NYX and then for mascara I'm going to use the Essence Plump Up Mascara and I'm also going to apply falsies off camera. Lastly for my lips I'm going to use this lipstick from Color Essence which is in the shade Nude Suede. This is a beautiful nude shade. I went in with a neutral color so that you know everything is balanced because my eyes were a bit heavy today. And this is the final look guys. So that's it for today's video. If you like this video then don't forget to give it a like. Don't forget to share this video with your friends and of course don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I will see you guys again in my next video. Till then take care.